Hi guys, how to get games here. Welcome back to another video. Today this is going to be part 6 of everything LSPDFR. We're going to be showing you how to install better radiance and better EOS reflections. This is very, very recommended for any kind of EOS vehicles. If you're going to be using it for LSPDFR or anything like that, this makes it look so much better. So like always, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you do, remember to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you right in the video. Alrighty, so to start off, just make sure you have Rinrar installed, and that's about it. But go ahead and go to the first link in the description, it'll bring you to this page. And you're just going to hit this blue button right here that says download this file. And I'll go ahead and start downloading. It takes 5 seconds, if it doesn't work, click that button. Then go to the second link in the description, it'll bring you to the better EOS reflections mod. Make sure you hit download that, uh, hit the download this file. And I'll do the same thing right here. And then you can see one already downloaded. We're going to wait for this one real quick. All right, downloaded already. Now let's go to your main directory of um, wherever your downloads goes, basically. And then you want to find your main directory of GTA 5. So like always, look in the description, description of any that's where any possible spot of your gta 5 might be or if you watch my everything series started from the beginning i told you to make the shortcut just right click it hit open file location don't worry about steam <laughs> so if you did that it'll bring you to your local uh your gta 5 folder this is my tutorial folder so it's nothing in there from previous nothing in there besides my previous videos so if you watch from the start your folder should look about the same but like always i will always say make sure you make a backup of your game but to get started real quick just go ahead and go to your um better sorry radiance one open that renrar open the file open this file and then you have a couple choices this is if you have Vigilant B, which I don't in this file order. <laughs> and then you have Brighter Daylight. You have Normal, or you have the Recommended, which is Brighter. Oh, that's actually the uh, brightness fix for those vehicles right there. Which, in this tutorial, I will show you how to do that real quick because it is very simple. So I'm going to pick the Brighter Day Police Lights. And just drag this folder to your, I mean this file, the Vision Witch 7 stop bat to your desktop. And then go back, drag this recommended folder to your desktop so you have it there. You can exit out of that Redmar, go to Better ELS. We are not done with the um, this one yet, but we're going to install Better ELS real quick. Just open Redmar, open the folder, this folder. And then you have a couple options. So there's main, recommend for realistic, brighter. Just do whatever you like, play around with it. But we're gonna go main. We're gonna do. Uh, what's this one? Brighter range. What's this one? Come on. Brighter takedown. So just do whatever one you want to do, or the recommended one. And then just drag this EM, this ELS dot. I and I into your main directory, it's going to ask you to replace the sit replace. And that's all you're going to do for the better ELS reflections mod. Now you can exit out of all your folders and you'll uh, be at your desktop with this visual uh, settings.bat folder and the better um, taxi train and right uh, brightness fix. Now you're going to need open IV. So go ahead and download open if you have it installed, whatever, uh, and just open it. Go to Windows. Let it load. It will show right here. Uh, just go to your mods folder. Make sure you hit edit mode. Yes. Mods folder. Open. I mean, um, you actually need to go to your update folder right here so update update rpf and then it's going to say copy the mods folder if you didn't already have it in there so make sure you hit copy to mods folder and there you go now we're in the mods folder 
and then go to common data and right here if i type in v you can see it right there so this is the file you're going to be looking for if you wanted to you can make a shortcut and then back it up or it's going to be backed up because it's not in your mods folder just go to the original game and grab it but all you're going to do is take the dot bat from your desktop and drag right into your um, game and you can see that it switched from encrypted to just compressed and there you go that is installed now i'm going to show you how to install the brightness fix which it does have a little readme which i would recommend opening because it'll tell you where these files are that you need to replace so just go back to your main directory gt5 you're gonna find uh, this folder, this file right here, which is gonna be down here. Open it, hit copy the mods folder, just like that, and then you just follow what it says. So, this one is gonna be levels, GD5, vehicles, actually, they're all in that one area, and then we're looking for air bus. So, just type in air bus. And then you can see the files are here. It went to the open the YT YTD file. So don't worry about the high one. Just worry about the uh, normal one right here. Double click it, and then it says replace the Airbus underscore LED sign. So you're gonna look for that, which is right here. Airbus uh, underscore LED sign. Hit replace. Go to your desktop you're gonna look for that folder you just dragged to your desktop right here recommended brightness fixed fixed files airbus and there it is right there and just hit open and then hit save and then you're gonna do the same thing for bus so just go up here and type in bus make sure you get the right bus so there's plenty of them so you're looking for this one right here open it this metro you're gonna replace metro bus led sign right here hit replace go back to the bus and right there open and hit save next we're gonna do it to the taxi in this file it wants you to do two um it wants you to replace two files this time so signs two which is this one wait sign two is right here I want you to replace this one. Uh, taxi science two. And I want you to do it to detail two also. Yep, taxi underscore detail two. There you go. And just hit save. And then the last one is gonna be the metro train. So just type in metro or type in train. Not doesn't really matter which one. Same thing before this plane folder i mean file double click it then this one wants to replace the led sign 128 which is gonna be this one right here hit replace go back to the metro train and there it is so that's pretty straightforward how to do that so you install the eos um better reflections and the brighter lights so we're going to go into the game real quick and I'll show you how that looks. So once you load into game, go ahead and spawn whatever ELS vehicle you have installed. So this one for example. And just hit J to turn on your lights and you can already see a difference. It looks much, much, much better. Switch to the night time so you can see how it looks at night. There you go. And you can see the reflections on the wall does look pretty good also. Which is the more night. That's even a thing. There we go. Looks a little better. 
but you can see the reflections even look pretty good and the EOS light well the lights in general look much better than they did in this default GTA 5 so like always I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did remember to hit the like button comment and subscribe and I'll see you next time